I was actually the first person in my family to graduate from college. And it is that which empowers every single one of our children to follow their dreams. Hi, my name is Ron Brady. I was diagnosed with ALS in July 2020. It began when my wife noticed that my speech was slightly slurred. They don't have enough information about ALS to give you a trajectory of your diagnosis. Some people live 20 years, some people only live a year. And so we said whatever it is for us, that's what it is for us, but we're gonna live every day to the fullest and just make our story our story. Losing my boys is difficult because I lose the ability to engage with other people. Having my synthetic voice helps give me some of that back. Hi, Daddy. Honestly, bye. Voice Keeper has been great. I hope the program can be improved so that it can say certain words better. For example, ironically, the program cannot say LS well. So instead, I say Lou Gehrig's disease. When I received the latest update of my boys, I became emotional because of now S is a progressive disease. When I heard my improved boys, it felt like it was the first time since being diagnosed that any part of me actually physically became better. I like to hear what he's thinking in any voice that he can tell me it's important for him to do that in his own voice. I want to come back. Mm -hmm. My favorite thing to say is any corny dead comment that will make my wife or adult children laugh. Look at all the good nice. parts. <laughs> I'm not doing so well. No, no, you're not. Where's all you smacked up? Who chose this game? <laughs> you did, buddy. Mm. Esta es mi voz en español. My Spanish voice is a pre-programmed one. Hay muchas opciones de voces en español, pero mi esposa seleccionó este voz porque es muy sexy. On the day I got diagnosed, she said, I want us to stop working right now so we can live every available remaining day together and to the fullest. And over the past two and a half years, and hopefully for as long as possible, that's what we've been doing together. The love hasn't changed. Our joy of life hasn't changed. We're pretty much the same people, just with a new diagnosis.